We have some really cool stuff to unbox. Let's unbox about it. Welcome to the gas cast. We're glad you passed by. You came at the right time. We had an all time line. Couple times, boys and chimes. Don't mind. Stick around, like, comment, and be sure to subscribe because life's a little better when you have some Chris and Heather. Hey, life's a little better when you have some Chris and Heather. Hey, life's a little better when you have some Chris and Heather. And remember, if you have a wall, we got together. Yes. All right, so I went to the P.O. box and I picked up all sorts of stuff. And I'm really excited to see what's inside. All of this stuff was sent by our awesome viewers. So a big thank you to all of you. But before we unbox all this goodness, make sure you hit that subscribe button and that little bell because we go live every single Sunday and we post a new video every single day and we are always here to entertain you. And before you go, make sure you hit that like button because that helps this video reach new viewers. And that helps us and it's amazing. All right, so the first item we have is from our friend Carlos Q. And he sent us, it, it, it looks to be like in a pop shield armor. Whoa! Okay, it says fire, sticker hose, double fire. Wow. Fire, fire has fire all over it. Special grail for them. Super grail. Super grail for them. Wait, it says something on the bottom. Fire, fire. 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 There's a lot of fire on this. So this is from Carlos Q and Carlos Q is amazing. Careful, you're gonna burn yourself. Get it, cause it's fire. <laughs> oh my god! Look at all the stickers! That's, that's incredible! That is the most amount of stickers I've ever seen on a Funko Pop ever in my entire life! Oh my god, Carlos! Holy crap! So typically, this Funko Pop comes with a glow sticker, flock sticker, chase sticker, and a pop in a box sticker. Wait, this is a chase? It this is. must be a chase, yeah! It's flock! That's amazing! Doesn't come with all of these stickers, but that's Hilarious! It is! I'm gonna keep it like that! I love it! Dude, thank you so much! And this pop is really great too! Do you wanna unbox it? Yeah! So it comes in a Pop Shield armor from 7 Bucks a Pop, and this is a perfect time to tell you to head over 7 Bucks a Pop and buy some of these Pop Shield armors. You need them for your collectibles, and look! It has a magnetic top, it's really strong, they stack really well, and this is the best pop protection on the market. Pop Shield armor from 7 Bucks a Pop. Alright, so this is the Cheshire Cat, and he glows in the dark, and he also is Locked. Look at this guy. He's so cute. Isn't that a cool Funko Pop? I love that Funko Pop. He's so cool. I love him. Do you have a glow? Do you have a glower? Oh my God. I don't have a glower, but we'll glow this toward the end of the video because we might have something else that glows in the dark. I have no idea. But thank you so much, Carlos Q. This is f***ing awesome. I didn't know that the Cheshire Cat had an Audi. What? Yeah, he has an Audi. Heather's right, he has like a little belly button coming off him. Chris, he's upside down. <laughs> or what? Okay, he has a little belly button coming off him. I have no idea what the right side up of this one is. <laughs> so this box is from Thomas Rinkax, and he says, hey Heather and Chris, hope these get to you okay. Thanks for all you do, and hope NYCC exceeds your wildest dreams. See you Friday the 7th, or on the live patron call on the 15th. Safe travels, Tom, aka Thomas, AKA Crohn's Iron Man. So that's amazing. Thank you so much for the letter. We love getting the letters. Wait, there's, he's going to NYCC? Apparently. That's awesome. That's amazing, right? So there's something in here and we'll get to that, but there's a pop here. Okay. And then there's also a pop here. So I know what two of these items are. Well, this one is Pedro Martinez, and he's a Red Sox baseball player. I don't know much about this, but it's a Red Sox exclusive baseball player Funko Pop. Nice. So that's pretty cool. We don't see sports Funko Pops here because we're not like super into sports, so it's kind of neat to see this in person. Yeah, he's really cool. I do like the sports pops. I just don't really care enough about sports. Total produced, 2,827. Wow. That's really limited. I didn't realize it was a limited pop. That's cool. That is awesome. And look, he's on a mound. Okay, so this is one I know exactly what it is. During our Patreon call a couple months back, someone had mentioned that someone else in our Gasol Cast We Hunt Together Facebook group was looking for this pop. I, Thomas heard, and he said he thought he had one. So he dug it up, and he sent it. Wow. Filch and Mrs. Norris. Oh, that's so cool. So our friend Ill Measured Beats is, like, really looking for this. So awesome. I'm going to send it over to him. Big shout out to Thomas Rinkax for yeah. sending stuff and hooking other people up. That's so awesome. Yeah, he's definitely hunting together. Thank you so much. It's going to make him so happy. I know what this one is. Oh, it's a Freddy Funko. <gasps> oh my God. 
God! It's Freddy Funko as Mandalorian! Mm -hmm. That's amazing! I've been really wanting this Funko Pop. That's so awesome! Isn't it? Yes, it's super awesome. Look, Freddy Funko as Mandalorian. This was one of like the high end pieces from the box of fun. A lot of people were after this. It's a 4K count. This is one of my favorite characters and it's Freddy Funko as Mandalorian. This is awesome, dude. Thank you so much. I will totally put this in a pop shield armor from seven bucks a pop. I got to protect this bad boy. You know, after all the people have been complaining about the box of fright this week, they were hoping for stuff in that box similar to this because this is grail territory. I don't see the ghost Freddy Funko as being like a grail territory piece. Can we not egg the people who are shitting all over the box on? I'm because just saying, like, no, this is, they're so annoying. This is iconic, and I don't think the ghost is that iconic, personally. I understand. But I think but this is what people are looking for. I my know, point. this thing is awesome, first of all. But second of all, don't draw those people <laughs> here to come and say, oh, well, yeah, I told you so. The box of Frank. No, uh. people are coming here specifically to shit post about the box of Frank. That's what they're here for. That Mandalorian's so great. Well, no shit. It's the Mandalorian. Yeah, this is f amazing. It is. So this huge box here is from our friend Chris Restivo. And <laughs> this is intense. There has to be a lot of stuff in here. I, I have no idea what's inside of this box. That box is as big as me. It, it is humongous. And it looks like it's literally, I can't show you the top because it has addresses, but it looks like it has made it around the world at least once. It's like opening a coffin. All right, I'm gonna put this on the floor. What the fuck? Wow, there's a lot in here. It says the Gasselcast fam. Oh, it's a dog dressed up as a ghost and it says gosh. Boo. No, let me read this. This is really Oh, long. there's a lot in there. As our coven grows and fills the world with mischief, we will hunt together, yes. Can't wait to get the concepts I've told you about finished up to share. Hell yeah. So glad you enjoyed my fan fiction theories. Best of luck at NYCC. Y'all are gonna kill it. The unpopular collector. P.S. He likes his butt sniff. <laughs> <laughs> and then the continuation of the front of the card says, did someone say treats? Happy Halloween. That's amazing. Just wanted to send some love your way for all that y'all do. Inside is filled with New Orleans treats and swag along with some Halloween themed items. Wanted to do more of a game with everything, but just didn't have the time to get it done. These are some family all boxes to open up first along with individual boxes for Chris, Heather, and Max. The box with all the quotes is for last. Okay. Okay, All thank right, so you. There's thank a you lot so in much. Here. This is unmarked. I don't know what's in here. Oh my God, he sent us the chips, Zaps. They're Ooh. the Voodoo, the New Orleans um, kettle chips. This is kettle style as well. This is called Evil Eye. Voodoo and Evil Eye. I don't know what the difference is, but do you want to try them? Okay, try this. Are they spicy? Not really. They look spicy. They're not. It has like a sweet taste to it. It has heat to it, but it's not spicy. No. I don't know what it is. They're subtle with mild heat, yet bursting with flavor. Ooh. Those are good, right? This remind me of salt and vinegar. Both of them have a little bit of a salt and vinegar taste. These ones more so. Do you want to open up the rest of the box or you just want to eat? I'm good with eating. They're pretty good. They're really good. So this one says Chris on it. Oh my God, look at the bats! That is amazing. That is awesome. Anyone up for the challenge? Oh my God, it's the one chip challenge to Packy. that. Oh my God, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that here, I, maybe one day. Oh, look at these little guys. Oh, those are cute. He has like his eyeballs out. Like they're binoculars. Oh my God, I love these guys. They're like little clown characters. These are so cool. Oh my God. We just got this in a, in a pack recently. So this is a Frankenstein sort of character from Boo Hollow. I love this guy. Oh my God, dude. Now I have one for me. He's in a little car. Oh my God, I love these so much. Cruise of Tux, wearing that. A beer koozie, Nola Brewing Company. Here's a, uh, a pack of matches, says Port of Call on it. So he's given us a taste of New Orleans here. Ra Shop, another beer koozie, Urban South Brewery. Bunch of stickers inside. Look at all these cool stickers. Those are really cool. Those are cool. All right, now we got some pins. Oh my God, there's a Destroyer pin and a Killer Clowns from Outer Space pin. It's Slim. Oh my gosh, look at him. He is so cool looking. Oh man, this is a great looking figure. Mm, he's Amigo. 
Yeah, he's a Mika figure. We have some other stickers, Crescent City Comics. Chris, with your newfound butt sniffing fetish out there, I felt like it was time to graduate from golden retriever butts to bare ass bare ass. Hope you find him to be farther than the average bare ass. Important note to remember, he's in the woods. Oh no. <laughs> It's Yogi Bear. Hold on, you got some things falling out. Look at this. I love Uranus. <laughs> Swamp ass. Look at him. Oh man, this is really cool. We don't have one of these, do we? No. He's so neat. Thank you, dude. This, this is all amazing. I can't believe it. There's like a little bit of everything inside of this box. All right, there's a Heather box. They got some bats inside. Oh, I got bats too. I was hoping I did. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Oh, you got like, lo is it like locks? No, it's purses. Oh, little purses. Yeah, I thought they were like little locks. God, this is the gaudiest thing I've ever seen in my life. I love it. Well, you said that oh, a little too yes, early. Yes, I did. <gasps> oh my God, look, more mystery minis. Look, another Boo Hollow character. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love these so much. These are great. Ooh, look at her. Oh, she's cool too. Oh, another Valentine. Oh my God, the little lamb. Those are neat. Man, I love these mystery wow. mittens. He packed, he packed this box full of them. My favorite. My favorite character. He's flocked and he's got an ax. Oh my God. That might be the best mystery mini I've ever seen. I love him. Oh my God, I love him too. Oh my God, I got chip all over me. The Villainous Valentine's line is one of my favorites. <gasps> oh, he's cool. It's a little a goose, goose pez. pez. Oh, I got a Reese's Pieces. Good God almighty. Oh, it's another one. Who's that? It's a cow. Wow. Did you like how I said that? Mm, can I eat these? Oh, no. Oh man, these are great. If I, if I eat these, I'm not gonna stop. Look at all the little creatures down <gasps> here. Oh my God, it's the glow in the dark. I wanted that one. That's so awesome. That's so cool. So we have a lot to glow in the dark and we have a black light character now too. So put him off to the side and we'll keep moving. Oh man, this is great. Thank you, Chris. Here's a box for Max. We're going to open it for him. There's bats inside, Aww, which he's is gonna lovely. Love that. He's going to love that. Oh my God. Look at all the dinosaurs that he got. All these dinosaurs are from the Jurassic World line. These are fantastic. They are. Look I at this these. one. He is so cool. Look at his little talon claws. Yeah, that looks like you when you don't clip your toenails. <laughs> Fruity pebble bites. Holy sh**. Oh my God, a box of boogers. Okay, Max can have that, but I was gonna say, I don't know if he's gonna be having these. Um, There's a Christmas vacation, uh, Twinkling Lights game. Oh my gosh, he's gonna love all of this. Something wild with Spider-Man. Block pop, that looks like a zombie. Oh, he's gonna love that. And we have so and much just so candy. many razzles and everything down the side of this. Oh my God, there's wow. so much. Dude, you outdid yourself. I don't know why you did all this. This is insane, thank you so much. He's so nice. Max is gonna love this stuff. This is so cool. Yeah, I don't think you should be saying that. Especially the box of boogers. Well, I think I'm gonna be having the fruity pebble bites because those sound fun. Oh no, how do you pack this in so good? Hold on, I have two more minis. There's two packs of these. Let's try them. No, we, we have to try the fruit. We no. have to try it. We have to. We have he's to. Got, we have to he's got, listen, he has baby teeth. We can't destroy his teeth. We got to try them. This is for Max's dental hygiene. Let's do it. This is f***ed up, Chris. It's okay. Here, you were going to do it anyway. No, your Off hands camera. are gross. Wow. All right, this is for all. And this says for all, too. Pumpkin pecan pie. That sounds pretty interesting. Well, that is for me. Oh my God, he sent the Tony's Creole seasoning. And believe it or not, we have had this before. We actually really love this stuff. That's amazing. And what's funny is we actually just ran out of this and I haven't been able to find it anywhere. <laughs> Look at all this. All these different cups. These are awesome. Look at the skulls on it. Crew of Boo. Oh, yeah. I like that. Crew of Boo. Haunted, uh, haunted history tours. Ghost Dots. Oh my god. Monster Pooper. It's you. <laughs> oh, and there's like a little balls in the bottom so we can poop them out. Mardi Gras beads. Look at all this. You know what? We can teach Max how to flash people for beads. Another Monster Pooper. Oh my god. More of these. Oh good. Put that in Max's box. We never Like it never it. happened. <laughs> it never happened. Top Pops. Top Pops. That's pretty wild. I didn't know there was a candy called Top Pops. Oh, oh 
man. Oh. Heather just made pimping easy. Here. Good lord. I'm ready. This is how you should go to New York Comic Con. It is. That's what I'm doing. And there's razzles and all sorts of other Holy stuff. Holy crap. Oh, there's so goodness. much in here. Open last. This is the very last box inside this whole thing. So this says, oh my god, there's a lot written on this box. It says, we all float down here ghastly. I uh, want to play a game. When there is no room left in hell, the ghastly will walk the earth. So this is all ghastly inspired stuff. Oh my god, hand me my robots! Gremlin Stripe! It's the bloody ghost face! -uh. Yes! Oh my god! That is amazing! We just it. talked about these! Wow! Insane! I cannot believe you got these. We have been talking about buying these for weeks and we just haven't bought them. Thank you so much. That is so sweet of you. He is so cool! Look at his mohawk! One of my favorite movies of all time, Gremlin. This is fantastic. One of my favorite movies of all time. Oh my God, Scream. that one's great. Look at him. He's he awesome. He is incredible. And look, even his tag is bloody. Oh wow, they hand numbered them. 287 out of 720. No kidding, wow. That's cool. And you can tell it was hand numbered because the ink has like sort of bled out a little like bit. Like exploded, yeah. Yeah. God, I love that. This is amazing. I, I, I don't know what to say. I mean, all of your guys sending stuff like this is incredible and we never expect it but we super appreciate it and we will love all the items that you sent us I think the best way to close this whole video out is to glow some of this stuff in the dark that we have yeah oh, oh yeah. that's great he's cool hell yeah Let's... His his smile doesn't glow as bright as I had expected but his eye was like wild well he's also flocked too yeah that probably has a lot to do with it it was probably oh look at him <gasps> That glow on E.T. is so great, and look how long it glows for. That is such a cool Funko Pop. Yeah, he's like super duper bright in person. Yes, he is super bright, and his chest almost looks like a galaxy or something. It has like a lot of light and different colors and stuff. It looks so cool. Yeah, he's freaking awesome. Oh yeah, he looks awesome. He is way bright. Holy yeah, he's cow. really bright. His colors look fantastic. Look at that. What a great soda. I love the black light stuff. Wow, this is amazing. This is probably one of the biggest hauls we've ever received at the P.O. Box. I can't thank you all enough. You guys are amazing. Thank you for thinking of us. And thank you for honing in on the things that we like. Chris for Steve knows that we like these types of characters. We talked about these in past videos. Um, these horror characters, this guy right here, mainly because we made fun of the stickers and Carlos Q was all over it. Well, you made fun of the stickers, but I don't think many people know that Alice in Wonderland is one of my favorite movies of all time. Absolutely. And Thomas Rinkax must have heard that I really wanted a Mandalorian Freddy Funko. So all of you, thank you so much. You guys are amazing and we appreciate everything. Like huge. Way huge. Like Almost as big as Tommy Lee. Hey, you don't it's, have to make it dirty at the end. It's hard to get that big. I'm, f I'm feeling really appreciative. I just don't think that I can... <sighs> I mean, that thing was f***ing Wind huge. it back up, Heather. Did just, you see uh, it, though? Yeah, I did, Heather. Okay. Thank you guys so much. We appreciate you. You're amazing. Guys, what do you think about all the items that were sent to our P.O. Box? And what was your favorite piece that was sent? Let us know all that and more in the comment section down below. This is the part of the video where we like to shout out to our patrons from Patreon and let you guys know you rock. In every video, we like to shout out to 10 of you. In this video, we'd like to shout out to Lee Stoneman, Ryan Drotar, Matthew R, Eric Hall, Retro Game G, Nathan Backen, Clarissa V, Carlos Campbell, Pop Cop 765, and Eric and Cassandra Golden. Thank you guys so much for your continued support. We appreciate all of our patrons. You guys rock. And hey, thank you so much for staying until the end of the video. We really appreciate you. If you want to support us even more, head over to patreon.com slash gasocast to find out all the ways that you can support and all of the perks that you get from it. All right, it's that time again. Remember, as always, we are together, yes. We'll catch you next time. Bye.